what's up everybody back in the garage today uh, i'm actually messing with my own car my little uh little bat as i call them my little svt focus if anyone's familiar with the what is it mk2 i believe uh focus or i guess it'd be mk1 yeah because it's the first focus um like the svts the zx3 zx5 etc then you know the the motor mount or actually the the main one, the transmission, the one that's on the back of the transmission, the, the torque support uh, mount, is notorious for wearing out the bushings and then you get an ugly vibration while you're just sitting there at idle or driving or whatever. So I went ahead and <clears throat> went onto the Steeda website and ordered myself a new mount. Here it is. It's a uh... They claim it the Steedo rear engine mount, also known as torque mount or um, lower transmission mount. But yeah, it's for the ZTEC and the SVT Focus, both guys. Um, <clears throat> but here it is, nice aluminum mount with uh, polyurethane bushings. So gonna have to slide up underneath the car and get this bad boy or get the stock one pulled out, get this one in. And let me get the stock one out and then I'll show how messed up the uh, stock bushings are. All right, so got the stock mount out. Uh, right away you can see like how old and deteriorated, uh, deteriorated, kind of messed up that word, but yeah, like how deteriorated the bushing is. It is uh has definitely seen some better days compared to this guy. And then on top of that, we also have up here it's it's pretty much cut. I mean, not from being cut, but just from how worn out it is. And then opposed to the uh poly style bushing. Um, so, yeah, this definitely will, I don't know if it'll completely take the, the vibrations out, but uh, it'll, it'll definitely feel a lot better. Sometimes when I come to a stop, I'll feel uh, like the motor kind of clunk, you know, from the, I guess, the, the bushing movement. So it'll take care of that. And then um, even as, uh, things as small as uh, the shifting feel, between shifts since the transmission won't be rocking back and forth and whatnot so overall this thing's gonna feel a lot better and uh i'm not 100 percent really thinking that it's gonna get rid of the the major vibration because of course it is a polyurethane bushing <clears throat> but it should overall feel better than this worn out bushing um so uh, let me get this bushing put on or, or let me get this mount put on and then I'll start it up and see if it sounds any better than than before although I didn't do a video or or anything like that of how it was before but I'll know if if it's any better or if it feels the same or or whatever the case all right here it is installed product uh looks looks good uh it's a good fit easy fit if you've never done it before, uh, it's pretty simple. It's just this bolt right here, this bolt right here. Those are the two that are actually for the mount, obviously. Uh, there's a, another bolt here and here that this bracket will come out of the way and allow the uh, mount to slide right out. Um, of course, just to be safe, uh, you shouldn't have really too many issues, but you know, use your jack. You can support the trans right here, and I mean that's pretty much it. Um, if you can't figure it out from there, then I really don't don't know what to tell you. Uh, have someone else do it. So yeah, now that the mount's on, fits great, of course. Uh, Stita's products are always very nice and fit well. So now to start it up and see what I think about it. All right, just fired it up. Uh, it, 
it feels smoother, way smoother than than before. Before I would start it up, the steering wheel would be shaking. Uh, the <laughs> even the buttons on the radio, you would hear them like vibrating. Um, there's a uh, even the the motor for the sunroof. You would hear it vibrating. That's why this panel is off. Uh, I was trying to figure out what the hell is vibrating up here. Um, there'd be like little vibrations in the in the roof panel and in, in the sunroof uh, cover. Um, but now uh, you don't you don't hear all those random noises. So uh, I'm excited to see how it's gonna be. Uh, um, when I drive it, I mean, it's just just a small little motor mount or trans mount, whatever the hell you want to call it. It's a little mount. It's nothing that's gonna make it faster or anything like that. Not that not that this thing has any amount of speed, um, but it's a very small mod that helps. And because of the poly bushings <clears throat> compared to the factory rubber one, it's gonna give it a a nice a nice long life. And I shouldn't ever have to replace that thing again, and especially for daily driving duties. So that's it. Till the next project. I'll see y'all guys later.